awaiting orders. Friendly Nippon strike on the way. Friendly mortars inbound. What's going on guys? My name is Brad and I thought you would enjoy that little video if you didn't really catch on to it. It was it was a mortar team that I had set up as my kill streak and you only get three of them to pick a location for and I got four somehow. So I thought I'd post that up and show you guys that. But anyway, today we're playing a little bit of domination on the map summit and uh I get a pretty decent score at the end of the game, it's pretty nice, but I do end up getting a couple of deaths, like in the double digits, but nothing around like 20. I get a few deaths at the beginning here, but it's nothing really that much to be like, oh, you suck, Brad. <laughs> like, oh, you're not good, you suck, look at how many deaths you're getting. It's like 12 or something like that. Anyway. The perks I am using, well, the class I am using, are is a FAMAS with sleight of hand, flag jacket, and tactical mask. All of them are pro. And the kill streaks I am using are napalm strike, as you've just seen there, mortar team, as you'll see later, and rolling thunder. I thought that it would be a little bit different than other people's channels. I don't know, I guess I was just trying something new, because you know how other people, they're like Blackbird Chopper Dogs, or sometimes they use Team Kill Streaks, like Spy Plane under Counter Spy Plane. Well, I mean, you never really see people using all airstrikes, or where you pick the location, you know, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I was going to, I'm going to talk about the gameplay a lot in this video, so if you don't like that, I'm very sorry, but... That is kind of the main reason for me making this channel. But I will touch up on a few other things. Like, like how that guy just tomahawked me, that got me angry. Anyway, uh, I did make a new account to try to get new subs to try to get subscribers or people to recognize my channel. I know people wouldn't like that. People are going to be like, oh, that's so selfish or something like that. I don't know. I, I don't really think it's selfish. I think it's all in the in the game. <laughs> like, you know, Optic Hex, he made an account that says YouTube Hex Wee. Well, why can't I make an account say YouTube Brad X Cod? Well, that's what I did. Anyway, um, what I wanted to talk about is this gameplay a lot. And I'm, I'm just going to get started. So anyway, here I am kind of smoked out in this weed weed smoke that's what I like to call it like weed smoke instead of the willy peat like weed smoke it kinda looks like cause it's all freaking smoke anyway I, I kinda get sidetracked very easily and my phone just went off anyway I do say that a lot so uh... I'm kinda camping a little bit because I recognize where they are on the radar and right there you see I get a quick death so I decide to take a different approach this time as you see instead of going down the middle I kinda check at C a little bit cause I I don't really know how I got him so instead of going from the side I decide to go from the middle and that did not work so it's always best to try a different route that's some good advice that I give and this guy, he's been running around with the ballistic knife the whole time. So I realized that people have taken B. So I die again. <laughs> now, I see this guy on C. Decide to take him out real quick. Another guy comes behind him and tries to shoot me with the tomahawk. And I die again. Surprise, surprise. Bye, Brad. Anyway. Okay. I realized that they captured B. So I decide that I'm going to try to take over this area as much as possible. So you see on my map, I mean, map, you see on the whatever, my, where my mic's moving, I'm telling my team to hurry up and help me with B. Now, since we get our radar jammed, that, that'll be a little bit more difficult to get people to know where our location is. So I decided to take a different approach while they take B, and they did. 
so this spot this spot right here is where I mostly hold it down I don't I don't like to call it camping I like to call it holding it down because I'm kind of like holding down this area and my phone just went off again and I kind of just pick up a new gun because I, I just have a weird feeling that I'm gonna run out of ammo so luckily enough I pick up this AK-47 with red dot and extended mags and that that is something that is really good now I realize that the enemy has SR-71 so I'm deciding not I'm gonna decide not to move that much now it's not camping it's just I'm gonna try to exploit their weakness like, cause you know, they're gonna eventually rush at me, but I'm also gonna know what direction they're coming in, but just not as good, cause we have our spy plane in the air. So now that our team's capturing A, I have a feeling that the spawns are gonna change, and they do, cause they have people coming right there. So there, I'm lucky enough, luckily, luck, ugh, there, I'm lucky enough to get my mortar team, and I call that bad boy in on A, because that's where they're spawning. Now, I hurry up and try to call this mortar team in a exact location while I realize someone's taken B so I jump around the corner and I kill that guy now I'm one kill away from my rolling thunder and I do like that kill streak but I die and I don't know how it said stuck on my screen I didn't really see anybody with a crossbow or notice anyone but it's all gravy now this guy down here he's he's gonna die okay so now pick up the stake out and die all right now I'm my spawn he said he's going pee I realized we're losing C I flash myself like a dummy so I throw that grenade on C and I kill that guy kill that guy got a nice little double kill and I am using my flashes like a beast now I realize we're being dominated and I am wasting my ammo terribly but I get a quick five kills where I get my napalm strike now I know that we took C now I'm gonna hold it down by B a little bit and just try to get my kill streaks up a little bit not really <laughs> being selfish but like I said exploit their weakness now I'll lay down this B 52 right in the middle and I wish it would come in like faster and stuff like instead of being all slow and I think I get a nice little double. Yep, double kill. <sighs> okay, now that I call in all my airstrike kill streaks, I kind of rush to the middle of B. And you'll see me repeatedly, repetitively, whatever, rush to B. And it looks like I get a multi at the bottom left of the screen, which is pretty cool. Now, I know that everyone's going to be rushing me after I die. So, I kind of take this guy, well, I'm about to take this guy out with the python, just because, just because. I don't, I don't know why I did that, I just wanted to kill that guy with the python, because it's just kind of fun using the python. Now, I know, I realized that we took C, so I decided to take a left, and then everyone just started rushing me. Now, and I get a nice little lucky grenade throw. Now, one thing if you ever see anything at the bottom of your screen that says blah 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 multiple attachments like AK-47 multiple attach multiple attachments or something like that then I would suggest to pick it up especially if you're not using Warlord because it's it's like you get the benefit of Warlord and Slide of Hand it's like your fourth perk so I mean I always pull out my secondary and pick up anything that says multiple attachments because like if they're using red dot and silencer or like I pick up this glue with the suppressor but that's all it has but I always look for something that says multiple attachments I would suggest pick it up because you get the benefit of a fourth kill streak I mean they'll have for example like maybe a FAMAS silence dual mags and also and, and they're using warlord obviously because that's the only way that they got the both kill streaks and get a nice little multi here and you are using whatever like whatever just pull out your secondary and trade it in that's that's what I always do to get that fourth little kill streak or whatever blah 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 
and I get a nice little lag here. I don't know if they were lag switching or what, but I lagged and I tried to knife that guy and whatever. So I realized that we're kind of getting behind or nearly behind. So I decide to take Charlie. And I'm going to hold it down at C quite a lot. C and B is like my main territory. Whichever side we start off on, well, my team starts off on, is the side that I like to finish the game on. Unless it's like a really bad side like Havana, it wouldn't really matter. So I pick up this stake out. I don't know why because I end up dying with it right after because I don't know how it didn't kill both of them. So, my team and I trying to come back and we end up can't well we end up not coming back so I'm like oh poo so I kill that guy and that's the end of the game alright I hope you guys enjoyed the video a little 77 and 15 4 captures 9 defends if you guys would do me a favor and like the video it's free it doesn't cost anything and if you subscribe you would save a kitten's life so think of the kitties Think of the free. I mean, everybody likes stuff free. And thank you. Later.